Champion, Ranger General, the Harbinger has struck at the Aegis Wall. She has made the first move. What is she planning? Yeah, that is a bit odd. Last time I was so confused because the great Chiron didn't appear and this whole voice lines didn't appear. And then she was like, ooh, Zeltov has attacked us. And it was like, huh? What? Without this? You have found me. Zeltov's army has been capable of striking at us for a while now. So what caused her to call, uh, choose this moment? Something is wrong here. She waited for us to blind, uh, build an army in response and then attacks openly. We are playing into her hands. Report to the Arathi General. I'll head to the battlefield directly. So, yeah. Huh? What? Um, that, without these voice lines, having as a direct uh, continuation of what takes me off of last time's quest, was just so weird. Damn. Anyway. Find to Hallowfall, then. Time to finish this hunt. Hell yeah. Oh, wow. <gasps> oh, yeah, well, so worth. Look at these guys. And there we have a wolf rider that I can't even... Oh, we have, like, everyone going here. Look at all these guys. Wow, you, we mass produced them fast. That guy is having some uh, height if, uh, pathfinding issues. Look at this army go. Hell yeah. Ground units, forward. Airships, open fire. I want to see every ballista loaded and fired within a minute. Oh god, the big guys are out. Damn. But yeah, you would have thought that like in the previous, uh, like in the start of the game, you, they would have more used underground areas because of the limitations they had of how to like restrict zones. We are far from the Empire. You're here. I'll keep it brief. The darkness comes. The might of Khazalgar. The Harbinger thinks she can catch off our guard, but she's a fool if she expects to win this fight. The Algari Offensive stands at your back, Grigon. Spare no enemy. Caution is warranted. Our forces may be able to hold their own, but seeing you in the fray may help their spirits. Take this Warhorn and let the, the, it ring out and fill our foes with terror. Once you're done rallying our troops, Make your way to our commanders. Yeah, this seems like a distraction. Or... It's a propaganda move. It's like, uh... Ooh, see? They always planned on conquering Nep... Uh, Ashkat. They built an army for that reason. You know? We lose so many to the darkness. Call Stormer, call in... A uh, strike from Storm Rider dealing 2 million nature damage to every enemy hit. Reduce the movement speed of the target, but. Wow. Hiya! It's literally Chobrip flying in. To deliver a freaking missile strike. Okay, you're all close. These three guys fighting this one chitterer. I do not have a target. Do -de -do -de -de. Did that? Okay, okay, it did work. <gasps> Call Golem. Hell yeah. Call forces, backed up by Elgari forces. Yeah, let's go. I'm not doing half as much damage as I thought I would. Stim the Nerubian Tide. Ooh. I don't like the wording of that. 
in a, like, oh, cool story, but ooh, does it mean... I get flashbacks to freaking, um, like, save the civilians of Teldrassil, and then you couldn't do it because of, well, yike rules. Maybe I should use... Ooh, hold on. Can I somehow convince y'all to target me? Not really. Ooh. Holy Fire Barrage, call down and bombardment of a wrath of cannon fire. Okay, you don't respawn really too fast, but I'll use you more often. Hair effect. Higher offend. Air offend. Hair. Air offend. What kind of weird type of elephant is that? Nope, not the one I want to. Oh, shit. You know what? There. Now we go. I don't like that the music did a big barrrrrrm when I defeated them. That sounded deliberate. When, like, the quest of, uh, objective was met, I was like, da Like, the, the music went a bit harder than before. Hi, Farron! Anduin! And... Random person? Oh no, the lynx. Not the cat. Not the kitty. A lamplighter brings hope. Your horde and alliance make a formidable army. I don't think there's much we uh, could have done without them. Don't give in to fear. Okay. That's weird that a story quest would have been de uh, delivered into two different. Mm. Champion, this way. Why are you here? Loktar. And why are you only here now? You have arrived just in time. Now is not the I mean, time to move. Good to know. Now is the time to fight. This is um okay guys. NPCs, Dollar. please. Another home lost to war. Okay, guys. They're right in front of you. It's not that uh, deep. It's not that hard. The time for dreaming is over. While we've yet to locate Zalatath, we've received reports from deeper in the field of certain Rubian giving orders. Renubians giving orders. It won't buy us too much. It won't buy us too much, but every f action is critical. Take them out. Hopefully that will allow us to some breathing room. Speak with Anduin after you are done. He and the Arathi girl went after Illyria. We all have our ghosts. Oh, that is such a weird roundabout way of doing the quest. That flew me f uh, threw me for a loop. Now that I, oh okay, it's all fine. But it was like, uh, why do I have to give uh, put this? Oh whoa! Let it be said, the wealth the last repays even the oldest of debts. Blood knights charge for Arthur for the light. I <laughs> yes, freaking what? What is it? A Lannister always pays their debts. That <laughs> Jesus Christ. I know what you're going for, but uh, the dark times will pass. You literally had multiple other lore moments where you could have repaid the uh, repaid the debts for other Arator, and it like Walker of Two, Walker of Three, etc. But you know, fair. You know what? Fair, lady. Uh, you know what, lady Adrian? Not only fair. You go, girl. You go. 
Who's joining me now? Kurlun Waldhammer! You know what? Here. You are very powerful. So I will need all the help I can get. Yeah. No, you don't. I love that Kurlun Waldhammer doesn't even say anything. He just joins the fray. Because. He, he just vibing. He here for the combat vibes. Oh shit. No you don't. Oh whoa whoa whoa. How did you still get me? Panic button, panic button. Could you not? Could you not? Could you not? Could you not? And off you go, Kurdren. Off you go. You deserve it. Ooh. Is the army of the light boys? Yep, here we have them. Light forged. Shining Warframe. Exodus Vigilant. Night Elves. Tight Sage St. Voidsinger. Ooh. Anub Ata. Dwarven sharpshooters. Let's go. This this feels like war. This feels like actual like we work together for this. The sons of Lothar fight on the same battlefield once again. Taste the might of Stromgard. While Lady Ladrin just chills there. Okay. Please remove ye. Oh my god, I need to activate that ability, please. Go away. Mm. Why do you... Why does it have to be after one another? Why can't it be overlapping? Ooh. Uh, <laughs> that was chaos. Utter chaos. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Belladar is being... We need to reach Illyria, quickly! Okay, <laughs> I... Interesting. We will not allow it makes sense that the quest did this, uh, did it this way, but it was, like, confusing. Anyway. Good, you made it. Together. We will be victorious. Something is very wrong. As the battle continues, each uh, each side has become more aggressive. Aleria seems to know something. She ran off a, at one point during the battle. We've been giving chase, but I can't leave these soldiers to die. She's just ahead. We can re reconvene with her together. Inspire others to do better. Start scenario. Let's go. I do what I can. That's not scenario, that's cutscene. Valyria. Can what? I? This isn't the real fight. Oh. Oh! Black blood. It's all around us. Turalyon, I... I have to go. What? The battle's about to turn. We've played right into Zalatath's hands. But I know where she is. And I'm going to stop her. I'm coming with you. I know you would. But your place is here. You to trust me. We'll be right with you. Come back to me. I always 
must do. Oh, the, mm, I don't like how this looks. It, it's, it looks great. I don't trust Teralian being in charge. Oh, scenario. Oh, good Pandaria flashbacks. Let's go. I'm sorry, but mm, didn't expect cutscene. Didn't expect this oppressive darkness. I can barely see beyond the airship's flame. Yeah. In my heart, there is fire. A beacon in the dark. Zalatath is here. I can sense her. We need to hurry. But first, we must find a way to light our path. Okay, come with us, Human Torch. Anduin, you good? Do you want to stay on the ship? Please don't, we want you with us. Also, Trevor, come with me. Oh wow, this is oppressive darkness. This is advanced darkness. Echo of fear. Living shadow, who are you? I don't trust you. It was the right decision. Ooh. Keep struggling. Let your emotions run. Every moment of defiance charges the air around you and feeds into me. It doesn't oh. It doesn't look like an Arati fighter. There was a bunny. I don't know if these are... Yeah, as soon as we get closer... Oh, tentacles. They turn to bunnies. That is so funny. I need to target something first. Oh! Ew! Did we see you before? Oh yeah, we did. That's interesting that the, like... Void riddled crocodile are still around. I need to target like something that. first. Because you'd think the they would have like died out in the Legion stuff. Call for aid. The sacred flame protects I us. I require a target. Okay. That didn't do the effect that all oh, the bar. Satellite's darkness grows ever closer. Spending too much time outside the light will force you to retreat. Yeah, it's freaking Battle for Azeroth madness. I can't keep that up for long. Oh, that is so sick. Okay. Oh! They literally... Oh, no. I hate that they, like having a heightened aggro range when we fight to me but also like only are visible when you're close that is ooh. yeah see I can't see them that is so sick that feeds into the whole madness of the void thing so the well saps my strength Okay. I think these are the Arathi soldiers who want to protect this place, but they have been like annihilated. They, they have been like literally like voided. I will bring light to the darkness. Okay, it's not a combat stuff, it's an utility thing. To like set the timer straight but it's lot it's like not a lot it's like bare the bones darkness saps my strength we'll cover you Farron focus on the brazier Farron focus on the brazier okay what Did I spend too much? Okay, really? 
Damn. I can't mount as well. Luckily I have some other utility abilities. Now that I defeated some of them, we don't need to teleport back. What's attacking me? And why? Oh. You guys. Great. Okay, Farron. Oh, did we activate this one successfully? Oh, that's what it was. Oh. I require a target. I thought. Never mind then. Let's um, continue. I completely misread the situation. I'm sorry. You could have given a voice line or like a text in chat or whatever to be like. You've done it! Or like an animation at least. You've done it! Let's go to the next. Let's teleport you back so we can do the next. Something like that. Uh oh. I need to target something first. Because there was no indicator of me having won that fight. Oh, you're a uh, night cultist guy. There. We should be able to purify that flame. It is so weird that her voice is just always this calm, always this composed. I require a target. We are in this Even together. this situation. Like, like, Farron, you sure we are okay? Are we sure this? Okay. Why did we do, like, no damage there for a moment? Oh, we still do no damage. There the Priory has a light well in the middle of the courtyard. No doubt it has been tainted. Okay, so we managed to accidentally skip that by running out at the same time as we uh, healed it. Gotcha. Makes more sense now that I think about it. Oh, that's literal tentacles there. Holy shit. Shades one crusher. Even the light burns with your rage as you carry candles into a starless night. Hey, a candle. It is not rage, but hope that guides the way. Dawn is ever on the horizon, Harbinger. Oh, do we see that character development that was mentioned, like that was hinted at before with like, uh, I say it's about hope, but it actually is rage. The courtyard is clear. Purify the well. It would be so cool if that is the case. The darkness has receded. Hurry, to the Priory! Darkness calls... The Broken Queen? Wait, what is that? All that remains of Queen Nephiris. Oh. Yikes. Now the uh, the broken queen. That is. I do not have a target. Mm. Mm, that that stings. That really kind of stings. Your world is dying. Breathe deep and accept that you have caused your end. That you have caused your end? Do you mean like because we healed and uh, revived you, basically? Oh no. I really hope we wouldn't have to fight her. Well, here's the holding of hope. May your soul be judged by the flame! Die, people no more! Shrouded in pain. Darkness! Something's wrong. She's fighting against her will. 
I'm not doing any damage now. She took so much damage from literally herself. Ferrin's <laughs> Ferrin. Ferrin. She's not dead. She's Salatath is just ahead. After me. Go. I'll hold the line. You sure? In the very heart of shadow, I will be the shield that guards the way. That is very tiny attacks on you. <laughs> oh. I'm assuming cutscene. Full rendered even. Oh shit! You know, Illyria, you mortals are the most wrathful creatures in existence. I've watched you break worlds, overthrow gods. Even the realm of death couldn't hold you. Your hunger for violence is insatiable. You lured us here. Unleashed us upon the Nerubians. All to fuel the Black Blood's power. My power. Oh, fuck. This stops now. <laughs> Your determination delights me. But I have risen from the ashes of countless empires. I have survived ordeals you cannot comprehend. You cannot kill me. I'm not aiming at you. Oh! Let's go! You're gonna call me wrathful now. This changes nothing! Raven? What? Why are you a bird? No, no, no. I heard your voice. This can't be. <laughs> you did well. <laughs> I knew you would stop her. Stay with me, Katka. Don't let go. Did we just... And win. Please. Shit! I am so surprised that I did not get spoiled about this at all. Ah! Uh. Fuck! 
no, amazing, holy guacamole. Jesus on a fiddle sticks, Jeremiah's Chrysler. There remains much to be done. Wow, I, like, I was like, oh no, she's absorbing a void energy, obviously, from Baladar's dark part, that is, the dark heart is now cracked. But not necessarily done for. That cuts it. Like, I was so surprised by the raven, by the burb showing up. <laughs> Which, um. Let's get this, to work. This cut. Wow! How was I not spoiled by that? Uh, no, not not by that. But how did I not get spoiled about all that? Did your arm actually disintegrate, or did you just did it just look like that because you were metaphysically like? You are spaghettified into the dark heart. Oh my god, I'm sorry about this one. Caught me so good. I was so tempted to keep my face come up, but I literally don't do that for Twitch recordings. Uh, for the reason of... I want to grab for thumbnails and cutscenes, potentially. Um, and all that good stuff. That is so satisfying and so gut-wrenchingly what the heckins, but also holy damn. Oh my god. I'm sorry, but this actually got me. I did not expect Cad Cadgar to be alive. But it, wouldn't that te theoretically mean that everyone who uh, who got sucked into the Dark Heart potentially survived? Or was it just you because of your magic? Danger lurks. Cadgar will need immediate help. We will have time for celebrations later. And for everyone wondering, Anduin can't resurrect fully. What he did was basically CPR. L light infused CPR. That is so freaking amazing. And I'm also super happy that this this was not taken away from him. Know your target. Oh my god. I thought Anduin still had some way to go. It felt like, but like, obviously there were so many situations, like, it just needed his will to, oh my god, manifest in this way. It's so great. I, I love this. Anyway, the battle is finally over, and I suppose it's time we lick our wounds. Head back to Dornegal, champion. I'll be right there as soon as Khadgar is healthy enough to withstand travel. Problem is, this battle might be over. Oh. <gasps> Execute. What is the Vizier of all people doing here in person? Anyway. May your aim never fall. 
Fortune smiles on us today. The battle is won, and in victory, we've had a dear friend return to us. Traces of Zalatath's presence linger in the air. In time, she will strike again. But for now, I believe we've all earned some respite. My faith kindles my hope. Lightforged Vindicators with Hyksark Teralion here as a clearly a lion's person uh, NPC. He has something different if we would be alliance, right? We are a light in the darkness. With the forces of Ashkehet and the Harbinger gone, Holofall has a moment to breathe. Beladar is safe, at least from outside threats. Now the only shadows left to uh, left to contend with are ones of our own making. Be strong, my friend. Excellent. Time to get to work. To see our old queen in such a state, your discretion and civility in this situation is a boon. We will take her back to Ajkahet and see if any of her former life is retaining in her. If not, we'll deal with it ourselves. Ask about Nefer's condition. It would have been easy for you to end Queen Nefer's life to secure victory. And yet you spared her. Words cannot capture my gratitude. I will escort my queen home, and bring word of your deeds to my conspirators. Return to the surface for now, and know that you will forevermore have allies in Ashkaret. That is so cool. That is so great. This is so amazing. It does feel, however, like it's supposed to play after the raid. Because... Like, it just makes it feel like, oh, this is... Uh, like, the, the ending of this feels a little bit like, oh, this is the end of the story for now. But it's... Like... The raid is... Something that happened... In between. Okay, no. Do you have an appointment? <sighs> Report what happened in Holofall. And so the battle is won. I Champion, turn. all of Kaz Algar owes you a tremendous debt. When you first arrived on our shores, we were fractured and divided. But you showed us the path to becoming whole again. You reignited our drive for purpose, and to define the parameters of our own existence. Condemned. We see now the traditions can change and evolve, and even be broken, if necessary. The Orathi no longer cower in darkness. We bring the light in our hearts wherever we go. This council stands stronger than ever before, with new friends and allies by our side. And we have you to thank for it. Dude, no need for that. I literally just followed the quest marker. As silly as that seems. With him a little fork. Uh, shit. How do I? There we go. Cool. Meet with Anduin and Dornagal. Sure thing. Sure thing. 
the butterfly. Whoops. Don't look at me, Anduin. Don't look at me. Look at the horizon. Stop looking at me. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Dromka. Greetings. Together, we are strong. There is honor in service. Oh. Your vo did your voice lines change? Our battle has been hard fought, but there's still much to come. There it feels good to know we made a difference here. And yet, I can still hear the radiant song echoing in my heart. Why did it lead us here? Was it solely to confront Zalatath? Or... Is there something larger at play? I'm no stranger to feeling like a greater calling awaits. But this is different, somehow. I just hope that we prove ready to answer it. That's interesting that they make it seem like end of the story. Like, sure, we... <sighs> We foiled her plans on that, but like. Hmm. Although this journey has been difficult, I've learned much. You found your light again. Sort of. More like I stopped running from it. Before he died, my father wrote me a letter. Yes! He said that I had to fight for peace. I thought that I had to become him because the world still needed him. Because I still needed him. But taking up his sword only led to war and death. I made mistake after mistake. I felt... Unworthy. Varian Rin was a fierce, proud warrior. I respected his strength. But you, Anduin, you have your own strength, greater than any sword. I'm not my father, but he never expected me to be. That's why he wrote that letter, to remind me who I am. It was his final lesson, and his greatest gift. The small emotions in these new animations during the Cell One listen. Oh. That hits hard. That hits... That's it. Hits calls. this we must spot. Answer. That hits the spot real well. There is much left to do. Your... Okay, no, that was just me. I thought your model looked Stay different. Stay alert. Look at him in his arcane wheelchair. For so many different magical reasons, you could have literally created anything. Why did you create an arcane wheelchair if you could have just created anything that is magical. That seems like redundant if you're gonna have a wheelchair to make it arcane. Just have one crafted. It's, it's like... Uh, anyway. Don't assume victory. Play movie. Remind me what happened to Zalatath. Oh, hell yeah. Still well, listen. It occurs to me that I never got the chance to properly thank you, champion. Were it not for your efforts, Dalaran could have proven to be an even greater tragedy than it was. We thought we had lost you, Khadgar. How did you survive? 
The Dark Heart was created not to destroy, but to capture and harness all manner of power. When I felt what it was doing to me, I transmuted myself into pure arcane energy. And allowed yourself to be trapped within the Dark Heart. Yes. Until you freed me. Ah, oh, that was a risky move. Trusting me to finish the fight against Zalatath. I knew you would do whatever it took to defeat her. Just like all those years ago. When we charged through the dark portal and closed it behind us to save our world. Both then and now, placing my faith in you was never any risk at all. That transmutation spell, however, that was not without consequences. What do you mean? You know, Cairdrin keeps saying I should just ride a griffin around. That seems terribly inconvenient, if you ask me. I much prefer this chair. Could that be because Archmage Modera designed it for you herself? Oh, why, Alaria? Whatever are you implying? <laughs> Only that you and Teralyon are so very alike. Bold in battle, shy in matters of the heart. I love her in <laughs> custom animations of this. And you are still the same old Deleria, I see. That I am, Khadgar. Void or no void. Oh, that poke back to the beginning. That is amazing. What? She's literally here. And fine. What? To stitch heal. I was Nephiris. I am. I'm glad you're doing well. Go away. My queen. Forgive me. I should have known your demise was manufactured by Zalatav. Widow. No. No. Do not look. Stay away. Nephiris, I've been apart from you for too long. Do not ask me to suffer your absence for another moment. I... Abomination hurts. Leave me, Naya. Never. After all that has happened, all that we've done, it was worth it to hear you say my name again. You needn't speak, my dear. I am here at your side. I will not leave you. All is as it should be. I freaking knew it! I freaking knew it! They're lesbian spiders and I love it! Oh, I'm here for it! That is so cute! It's so bittersweet, but it's so cute! I love this so much! <laughs>